guys, so today's video is going to be my Valentine's Day treats and gift idea. So I have three food related things that I'm going to show you. Two of them are a cute Valentine's Day breakfast, so it's one drink and one food item. And the other one is a cute gift idea that you can do yourself, which I think are often the most thoughtful gifts anyway. And if you don't have a Valentine's, that's fine. I made these and I ate them with my roommate. So you can always make them with friends and just have a fun heart related party. Or you, you can just make them in other shapes and don't make it Valentine's Day related if you don't like that. So yeah, if you're excited, then continue watching the video and I'll talk to you at the end. The first Valentine's treat I'm going to show you is a lovely strawberry smoothie. So you start with strawberries. Frozen ones are better because it already gets the icy texture to your smoothie. Then I would recommend some yogurt. And the best one is more a liquid yogurt that it's easier to drink. Then we're going to need some sugar and a spoon to take the sugar out, obviously. Next we're going to need two cl glasses to put the smoothies in. And one I fill with water because that's also one of the ingredients. And finally we just need some cute straws. I got mine at Target. So we start by pouring some yogurt into the blender. And this is about the amount you need for like two smoothies. Then I just add a bunch of frozen strawberries and I add them while they're still frozen. I add a little bit of water, not too much because you still want the yogurt texture. And two well it's not really a tablespoon it's more like two half tablespoons so you could basically do like one big tablespoon but i wasn't sure how much sugar i needed so then make sure you put the lid on properly and just blend it all together and then you just pour it into your cups and add the straws and you have two delicious smoothies the second Valentine's treat I'm going to show you is heart-shaped pancake skewers. You need a mix to make pancakes. You need milk because I needed it to make my pancakes. You need a cutting board, skewers, bananas, and a heart-shaped cookie cutter. So I made my batter and started by baking the pancake. And then once the pancakes were done, I cut out heart-shaped pancakes using the cookie cutter. So I collected a bunch of them. Then I already cut my bananas and I just put one slice of banana on the skewer. Got some pancakes and added some chocolate to it and put them also on the skewer. And then I continued doing this until I had these delicious treats. So then I decided to make my table look nice for a cute breakfast. So I put some candles on and got some flowers, then I got the smoothies and obviously the pancake skewers and you have a perfect Valentine's breakfast. As a gift idea I'm going to show you how to make heart shaped chocolate bars. So for this you will need chocolate obviously, then you will need some aloe foil, some candy you want to put into your chocolate bars and a heart shaped then I just made the chocolate in little pieces and put them in a, in a pan which I put on top of another pan with boiling water to make the chocolate melt. Then I just made my candy into smaller pieces because they were kind of big. And I also put some foil in my shape so that the chocolate wouldn't stick. Then I poured my first layer of chocolate in there which is just the base layer so it shouldn't be too thick. Then I put some of the candy in the chocolate because it's going to be the inside of the chocolate bar and pour the second layer of chocolate over and make sure that you have like every corner and that every candy item is covered. And then at the end I again decided to decorate this layer with a heart and you to make love you. I put them in the fridge and let them cool down and then I just removed the foil and I was left with these really cute heart-shaped chocolate bar, which I put in a cute little bag. Okay guys, so that was my Valentine's Day video. I hope you guys enjoyed the ideas and if you try any of these yourself, 
please send me a picture on Twitter. My Twitter will be linked below. And if you have any other requests or videos you want me to do, please comment below. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up or subscribe. It would mean the world to me. And I'll talk to you soon. Bye!